I came into college as a physics major, um, and during that first year of physics, I actually took a lot of chem courses, um, and during that time, I realized that um, a lot of my friends were struggling with the concepts of chemistry, whereas I found them to be very relatable and really understandable. Um, and I specifically wanted to teach chemistry, um, mainly because I thought that chemistry, I felt like there was the largest discrepancy between um, how hard the subject is perceived versus how hard the subject actually is. And so as an educator, I felt like I could do the most good by sort of trying to bridge that gap for students. Um, and so I like to relate chemistry to real life by bringing real life examples into the classroom. And that way, um, hopefully it helps the students realize that um, you know, chemistry is all around us and that it's not as hard as people make it out to be. So what I expect students to get out of my class is uh, not only the chemistry concepts um, that I teach, but also just being able to utilize those skills um, in the real world. For example, there was a student who came into my course as a different major, um, but after taking my course, um, he switched over to a chemistry and computer science double major. And um, now he's actually working with a gaming company where he can actually utilize both um, his computer science skills and the critical thinking skills that he developed in my chemistry course um, to do his job. And it's always refreshing and inspiring to hear back from uh, my former students um, who tell me how they've developed skills here um, at UCLA and are able to utilize that um, in their everyday work. I'm Dr. Hung V. Pham. I'm from Garden Grove, California, and I teach organic chemistry at UCLA.